navigate the iOS by using Teraterm for console connectivity, the topology, Various models of Cisco routers and switches are used in all types of networks. These devices are managed using a local console connection or remote connection. Nearly all Cisco devices have a serial console port to which you can connect. Newer models you sit in this lab, such as Cisco 4221, also have a USB console port. The required resources are router and switch. A router 4221 or similar on switch Cisco 2960 or similar and a PC with Windows and rollover DB9 to RJ45 console cable to configure the switch or router via RJ45 console port or a mini USB cable to configure the router via USB console port. Access a Cisco switch through the serial console port. Connect a Cisco switch and computer using a rollover console cable. Connect the rollover console cable to RJ console port of the switch. And Cisco switch and the power cord. Uh, and finally, the rollover cable connected to the computer. Serial COM ports are not longer available on most computers. A USB to DB9 adapter can be used with the rollover console cable for the console connection between the computer and a Cisco device. If using a USB to DB9 adapter to connect the COM port, you may be required to install a driver for the adapter provided by the manufacturer of your computer. Turn on the Cisco switch. Configure TerraTerm to establish a console connection with the switch. Okay, go to control panel to verify. Hardware and sound, device manager. Go to uh, ports com, uh, USB COM8. Okay, so you can uh, access to TerraTerm and select serial and you can see COM8 available, okay? And font 14, okay? Enter. Uh, would you like to enter? No. It switch enable. Configure terminal, okay? Uh, configure terminal and very good okay uh, go to uh, uh, go to setup serial port uh, port com8 bout rate 9600 data 8 parity non stop one bit flow control non okay Okay, and the default parameters for the console port are 9600 baud, a data, no parity, one stop bit, and no flow control. Display a uh, configure basic device settings. Display the switch iOS image version. After the switch has completed its startup process, the following message is displayed. Would you like to enter the initial configuration dialog? 
okay this message okay and no okay enter now and uh, enter uh, while you are in user exit mode you can use show version commands if you don't see the above message please contact your instructor to reset your switch to the initial configuration while you are in user access mode, display the iOS version for your switch. Okay, uh, show version. Enter. Space, space. Exit and go to, for example, user access mode, show version. Also, you can see from user access mode. Enter. And this is the image. This is the image on Flash. Uh, okay, the iOS image. Which iOS image version is currently in use? Uh, by your switch. This is 15.0, or also you can see the version on the iOS image here 15.0. Okay, 15 zero. Now, uh, configure the clock. You can use show clock, show clock, and go to enable to configure the clock. Enable, okay, you are in privilege exit mode. Clock set mark question to view the options. Okay, mark question and uh, current time. Okay, hour 11 minutes 18 second zero zero. Mark question again month December, for example, space mark question day of the month. Um, 18 mark question and year 2018 enter and ready enter show clock and this is the new configuration optional access a cisco router using a mini usb console cable if you are using Cisco 4221 router or other Cisco iOS devices with a mini USB console port, you can access the device console port. Verify that you are using a mini USB cable, not a micro USB cable. Set up the physical connection with a mini USB cable. Connect the mini USB cable to the mini USB console port of the router. Okay. Verify the USB console is ready. A USB driver must be installed prior to connecting Microsoft Windows PC to Cisco iOS device with a USB cable. Okay, this is the link. And download here. Logging the accept save this is the driver and uh, extract so install this when the LED indicator for the USB console port has turned green, the USB console is ready.
enable the COM port for a Windows PC, control panel, uh, device manager, hardware and sound. Okay. Device manager. The ports. Go to ports, expand, and USB serial device COM 15. Okay, Terra term. And go to serial COM 15. Okay. Uh, font 14. Okay. Enter. Would you like to enter the initial configuration dialog? No. And enter. The. Okay, uh, enable configure terminal and 